Today, we're going to show you just how easy it is to make an infective liquid laundry detergent using our concentrated base. With just a few simple steps, you will have a powerful detergent that tackles a wide range of stains. Let's get started. To make our liquid laundry detergent, we need to dilute this base with water at an 8 per 1 ratio. For every part of the base, we add 8 parts water. So today, let's have 10 grams of concentrated base and 80 grams of water to have 90 grams of mixture. Okay, now we have got 90 grams of a mixture of our concentrated base and water. Now we need to do some stirring to have a homogeneous mixture. Our concentrated detergent base has excellent water solubility, allowing it to dissolve quickly in water. This makes our mixing process very simple and fast, requiring no sophisticated or advanced mixing equipment. You can completely dissolve it manually with a sturdy stick in just 2-3 minutes. After fully mixing and dissolving, the mixture is now completely clear and transparent, but it lacks any viscosity. It's watery. Now we need to add a small amount of salt to achieve the desired viscosity. It's crucial to control the amount of salt added to avoid oversalting, which can decrease the viscosity. Adding salt in the range of 0.8% to 0.85% will give us the optimal viscosity. So in our case today, we need to add around 0.72 grams of salt. After adding the salt, we need to keep stirring the mixture slowly for about 1 minute to achieve the viscosity. Now as you can see, the mixture becomes very thick. Now let's add some fragrance. In mass production, commonly we add 0.3% to 0.5% fragrance in a liquid laundry detergent. We need to stir for a while now for the fragrance to be fully mixed with our detergent. Finally, let's add some pigment to give it a better look. Now, we have our original looking well-perfumed laundry detergent liquid. So now let's start making um, these clothes dirty uh, to put some stains. Uh, these stains, um, first of all, this one uh, from uh, the greasy oil from uh, cooking. Uh, from cooking chicken actually, from cooking chicken meat. Okay, it's very greasy, very thick uh, oil and it's too much oily. And then this one, coffee and uh, And this one from uh, blueberry juice, okay. Blueberry juice. And this one uh, from uh, green grass.
and then this one from uh, tomato. And this one, last one from strawberry. Strawberry juice. Okay. So we will leave it for like 10 minutes to in the sun. So we will leave it in the sun for like 10 minutes to dry it. And then we're going to wash this um, dirty cloth with the detergent that we just made from our concentrated base. See this one it's um now after setting for a while it is um very clear and um thick now after join the cloth in the sun for 35 minutes it is now dry and the dust is uh, they are dry see all these are dry so let's uh, start um, stimulating the wash and the laundry process with our with uh, detergent we just made from our concentrated base and See, let's see it's a uh, cleaning performance
okay now we have done this washing for 20 minutes and uh, let's see let's uh, rinse it off and to see how um, it looks Okay, now let's uh, take it out and rinse it off. Uh, we can see that um, most of the stains are gone only some stubborn stains like the um, one from uh, coffee and uh, from uh, the blueberry and the strawberry they are somehow they are like um, pigments they are dyes um, so it is hard to remove these stubborn stains unless we have a bleaching agent in the detergent